Now, there's some certain rules that help improvisation. Okay, and I want to do a few little games that will help us to get to understand those rules. What I want is for A to make a shape with their body. It could be anything. They haven't got to think about it. That's the thing. The first thing that comes to mind. Anything. It doesn't matter what you do. You just do anything, but you hold it. Whatever you do, you hold it. Okay, make sure it's something you can hold, that you're not going to fall over. When they've done that, B's job is then to make a shape next to it or with it that makes some kind of sense of it. Anything, it doesn't matter. You know, all of these things can be made into something. I'm not thinking about this at all, it's just happening. Yeah? <laughs> Maybe it's stupid, it doesn't matter. kayaking through the waterfall? Are you running through a jungle being uh, chased by a tiger? Are you? And the other person just does it. They don't think about it, they just go, yes, I am running through a jungle being chased by a tiger. Okay, and then actually just let A keep firing things rather than swapping it. Okay, are you eating the biggest breakfast you've ever eaten? Yes, I am eating the biggest breakfast I've ever eaten. Okay, so A, just keep firing things at B, and B has to keep doing them, but B has to say, Yes, I am. Yes, sir. I'm coming in the bridge. Expanding it, you're turning it into a story. Okay? So again, it's very important to say, yes, I am playing the piano, or yes, I am tying my shoelaces, and my fingers are just falling off, whatever it is. Yes, I'm fishing! I caught something! I caught a mackerel shark! What I want us to do now is I want us to make up some scenes. Every single thing that you've ever watched, Ever, 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 probably, unless it's a documentary, but if it's a story on the television or in the theatre or in a film, you have something where somebody wants something. They want something and there's something stopping them getting it. There's a sense of conflict. There's always people with opposing views. Or well, somebody wants something, they, 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 they really want to get something and they can't. Or there are two people that, that disagree about something. The word's conflict, okay? So there's a young girl that works at the factory, okay? So we've got a young girl, and she's a sister, which suggests that she has a sibling, which might be a girl or a boy, yes? Maybe a little baby girl. A little baby, yes. okay? And so we've got a little baby. Who's he gonna be friends with? He befriends somebody that works at the mill from one of these families, so who can he be a friend with? Yeah, you could be friendly the overlooker, but the overlooker's quite nasty, but that could be interesting. The overlooker could take a shine to him. Girl. Or the six-year-old girl. Okay. Good. Now, already, we've got possibilities, haven't we? We've got all these characters, and we've got all these possible relationships. So, first of all, let me ask you, if we had the father Okay, talking to the sister. Now the father obviously is like, you know, is a grown up, and the girl's only six. What could they be talking about? You want to look after your baby sister, don't you? Yeah. Well, if you go to the mill, you can get more money so you can feed her. So you will be looking after her, really. No, but, no, but you earn the money at the mill. I'll look after her. Hello? Hello, Mrs. Smythe. I've got something to tell you. What? Um, your six-year-old daughter who came to work today, um, we found her a bit later and her finger was chopped off somehow. How? We don't know, we're currently investigating. Where has she gone? To hospital. Hospital? Yes. Why can't you come here and of that horrible, dirty, smelling place? <laughs> you can offer us some money? Um, I can offer you £300 compensation. I don't want your mind, it's not my granddaughter here. I've got a baby to look after, but still. 
I could do with the money, but I'm not going to take it. Well done. Very good. Round of applause. <laughs> She didn't want to be caught. Right, where is she now, though? Hey, everyone, have you heard the news? What? Oh. Elizabeth's fingers got cut off. What? Has that happened? Has that happened? Some urchins. Some urchins, that's a good idea. Window cleaners, very good idea with all those windows, and that was one of the things we did. Please, uh, we need somebody else to join our team. No, we need somebody else to be on our team. Look, yeah, there's a couple of artists. We are painting the beautiful moon. Do you want to buy some fish? Do you want to buy some fish? 